you know what I've really been noticing up until this point? We haven't really talked about Entropy 02 all year yet, and it's already almost April. How could that happen? How have we not talked about one of our favorite currently in development mods for almost three months? Well, a lot comes down to the fact that they haven't really given us much updates since the last time they spoke out over on their ModDB page. There was the January update, but it wasn't a whole lot of stuff they showed off in that one, so I refrained from talking about it. But since they very recently posted another update to the ModDB page, I thought it was probably a nice idea to take a look at where the mod is standing right now by taking a look at the two most recent ModDB updates. Let's get Entropy zeroed. Lambda Federation. This week's Fan Art of the Week award goes to Lambdagen user at Premislot and their amazing looking wooden headcrab that they made in Woodshop class. It's an amazing piece of work and if something like this were to be sold, I would probably buy it. Want me to talk about your artwork in this segment? Well, that's possible. Just send your artwork in the fan art category on community.lambdagenneration.com and maybe I'll feature you next. Let's rewind the time back to January for a second. Times were a little bit simpler, everybody still had the New Year jitters, and Breadman released a new small media update on the Entropy02 ModDB page. The reason why I skipped out on covering this update on the YouTube channel when it first came out is because there's not a whole lot to cover here that we didn't already cover in some way, shape, or form. One major bit of news to take away from this media update though is that the game has officially entered the beta stage, meaning that the game is getting closer and closer to officially releasing. This is crazy because I remember covering the development of this game slash mod since 2018, which is when I first started making videos on this YouTube channel, and the project at that point was still called Entropy Zero Arctic. It's definitely gonna be a surreal moment when this game finally releases. Beta testing is also being talked about again in this update. You were still able to sign up at that point, but you're not able to anymore as the forum has already closed. So if you missed that, I'm sorry. But hey, the wait for the game to release shouldn't be too long anymore. A gameplay video was also shared in this update showing off the Zentarium section of the game. It shows a lot of zen flora and fauna and overall has a pretty ominous atmosphere. I love that. It's almost 3 minutes long so if you want to check it out it shouldn't take too much time out of your day while doing so. Let's go back to the present day, or rather 6 days ago. Breadman posted a new update over on the ModDB page that is actually a little larger than the previous one, but that's because it contains a lot more gameplay for us to sniff through. I'll get to that in a bit. First off, Breadman speaks of the current progress of the game's spoken dialogue. In case you don't know, Entropy02 has several new fully voiced characters for us to listen to, and all that dialogue is being finalized in this stage of development, specifically the dialogue for the final sections of the game. Some scenes were rewritten and others have been slightly tweaked due to playtester feedback. There is no news yet on when the big playtesting phase is going to happen though. You know, the one you may or may not have signed up for. But Breadman does state to stay tuned. It should probably not take super long anymore. Since Entropy02 is going to officially be released on Steam, it's going to have achievements as well, and most of them are already implemented, setting the current achievement tally to about 32, which is a pretty nice chunk. So now we finally get to the gameplay section of this media update, and like I said, there is a lot of it. Four whole gameplay videos have been shared here from the Arbite facility, the Lab Raid, Zen Grenade Assault, and Lake Turn... Turn Gate? Turn... Turn... I, I don't know. Turn Gate? Uh, all of them are about two to two and a half minutes long. Apart from the regular gameplay videos, we also got some previously classified developer videos made declassified. These three videos come complete with developer commentary, good content, and early development stuff. So if that's something that tickles your pickle, then definitely have a look at this. We got videos from the Cut Zentarium expansion, some pit drone combat tests, and a test for the Boyd creatures that we'll be seeing flying around all over the place, especially in the more zen-invested areas of the mod. 
And that's it for the March update. It's a pretty small one still, but it does have a bunch of interesting content that I thought was worth covering. And hey, it's always nice to be hearing from the Entropy Zero Two peeps again. Let you know that they're still hard at work on getting the game out, and man, what a game this is going to be. But hey, they're not the only ones who were hard at work on something. We have also been super hard at work on creating something brand new. Something pretty awesome that I think all of you will absolutely love. And we'll be announcing that thing tomorrow, so stay tuned to our social media for that. In the meantime, be sure you also follow Breadman on Twitter, and of course, don't forget to follow the ModDB page to stay up to date on when they post something new on there. But Twitter is by far the best place to stay in the know. Man, I wish this game would come out already, but patience is key. Hey, remember Lambda Builds, our mapping competition that just closed its first ever competition called Infocomp Start? That's right. I just wanted to say here that you can no longer submit regular submissions. Anything you'd submit now would be considered as a bonus map and that's a thing until the end of today. Bonus entries will not be judged. Anyway, thank you all so much for participating. It's been a crazy experience and we hope to be doing it again very soon. Stay tuned for the release of the compilation. It'll be out very soon.